you know, what, anything else that you were struggling with or that was a big challenge in your business? No, I think the confidence was the biggest, biggest, biggest thing. Like where I am, I know I had a knit, I had a market that needed to be tapped, but I didn't know how to do it. I didn't know how to stand up for myself. That was pretty big. No, that, I mean, that is big. I mean, you can't really put a price to that because that's something that's going to, that's going to positively impact you and your business forever to have that confidence piece. Wait, you're way more bold. You're way more willing to stand in your value and communicate uh, and pursue partnerships. And that's, that's like, that's a skill that you'll take with you and have forever. I had no rhyme or reason. I had like a baseline of what I charged, but I never followed up with it. (laughs) Um, I let people do session by session. Now it is like, I do five lessons for 375. Mm. Before that, I was all over the place with it. And I was like, oh, it'll be $50 today, I guess. Um, If you want to keep going, You know, it was not assertive. Like it wasn't like, this is how it is. Mm -hmm. And now it is, this is how it is. Mm -hmm. And you can take it or leave it. I was definitely like hoping that people would stay with me. And now I'm definitely like, here it is. I'm not going to compromise myself with all the education and travel and all the stuff that I do for people. Yeah. So it sounds like there was a shift in your confidence level. Yes. Having those structures in place, how has it improved your business? Like, I guess it's just more legitimate. Mm -hmm. I feel more professional. Mm -hmm. More like this is a real thing and not just, hey, I'm going to mow your lawn for 20 bucks. Yeah. But a big part of it was that, yeah, you weren't protected and you were losing money as a result. And, and now that you have those structures in place, you're getting people that are committed, people that are paying and people that are showing up. Yeah, no, yeah. yeah. Okay. That's amazing though, that you've already gotten three out of 10, which was your goal. And so, you know, and that's only in the past few months. So you're on par, you're, you're averaging one a month in general Sweet. and without even doing a lot of marketing, like it's because you have a referral system through that, that vet or the, no, sorry, the breeder. The breeder. Yeah. You no, know, yeah. I'm charging 2,500. 2,500 per dog to stay with you for a month or how long? A month. And a then 1,300 for two weeks. Okay. And you now have two board and trains. So you generated uh, one right now mm-hmm. over there. And then I have two coming in October. Nice. It's a huge portion of income. So May was 7,000 and then June and July were four. Um, I mean, it's a lot more than what I was making. Yeah. yeah. But would, you, still, would you say I, you like doubled your income or like what, if we could put like, or what would the percentage be, you think? Double would be appropriate. Wow. 